This is Inside Yale Football, brought to you by Yale All Access. Week one of Inside Yale Football for the 2012 season. The Bulldogs fresh off a thrilling, to put it mildly, 24-20 win at Georgetown on Saturday. Ron Vaccaro, I'm joined by Chris Dooley, senior defensive player for the Yale team. And Chris, your thoughts on that opener? That was that was as wacky as they come. Yeah, it was it was pretty crazy. I don't think I've ever been played in a football game like that before. Um, just you know, like kind of a roller coaster. Um, but for us, it was kind of nice. You know, last year we had a lot of kind of emotional roller coasters too. This year we kind of were able to keep it on an even keel, which was nice, even with all the ebbs and flows of the game. So it was uh, definitely definitely a good way to start the season. You're someone who has really emerged over the past several seasons as a force on that defensive front. Why don't you talk about the personality and the characteristics of this year's defense? Yeah, I mean, um, you know, I think our defense this year is definitely marked by, you know, 11 guys to the ball. And uh, we've really put a focus on playing well together and uh, an attacking, you know, fast physical defense. And I think that's really emerged with like the coaches and they've really put an emphasis on it. And I think that's our characteristics. And I hope what uh, people, people feel like when they play against us. Long preseason, grueling preseason. Yeah. How excited were you guys just to get back on the field and play somebody else on Saturday? <laughs> it was really nice. I gotta say, like, you know, it was almost like a game was almost a break from practice, and so, you know, it was uh, it was really nice. And uh, you know, it's it's a long time hitting the same guys over and over, just playing against the same team over and over, and uh, to kind of be able to finally get out there and uh, hit it, hit someone else and take it to someone else. It felt it felt really good. Long time coming. Now we're also going to talk with uh, Cam Sanquist today. Yeah. Now when you you guys have that big turnover as Georgetown's going in, and then you know Yale's pinned on its two-yard line. Did you see the play, the 98-yard touchdown? I, I was on the we uh, we just got off the field. I think it was a uh, pretty. I forget how long the drive was, but I was on the bench, and uh, I saw the ball go up. I didn't see what happened. I just heard our guys yelling, and I saw Cam running and. Uh, I said it must be a good thing, so I guess so. Um, yeah, I didn't, I didn't actually see the play, um, but yeah, it was definitely a big lift for us, and definitely got the momentum back in our favor when it looked like you know might have been slipping away a little bit. So now I'm, I know you're one of uh, you know a lot of Bulldogs who find time during the summer to manage the football commitments and also do some other interesting things. Why don't you, what have you been up to since last on the field? Yeah, um, I mean, this summer I worked for UBS um, doing their sales and training internship. Um, so basically I just went around shadowing, uh, you know, different business people and learning about what they do, learning about financial markets, things like that. Um, so basically my summer, my summer day was pretty, pretty simple. It, it started with me waking up, going to work, eating dinner and working out. That was my all my whole day it was just work and football um it was nice it was good it was you know it was, it was i was able to do both and um you know i came back here feeling good and feeling ready so i was it was a great opportunity i'm actually going back so i'm pretty excited about that too well, congratulations on that thank you. thank you and uh you know aside from the obvious changes with the new coaching staff lots of new younger personnel in how, how does being a senior just change your perspective at this time of the year um not really sure. I, I, I don't think it changes it too much. I mean, I, I think definitely I start to feel like almost it's coming to an end. Kind of see that. I finally see it that, it, like, you know, I don't have too much time here left and I just have to give it everything I have at this point. Um, but it doesn't, from a, from a team perspective, I mean, you know, I, I try not to look at freshmen, sophomores, juniors, seniors. It's just one team. Um, so from that perspective, it really doesn't change that much. Feeling comfortable in the 3 4? I, I love the 3 4. I think as, as a D lineman, it's harder for, you know, offensive line to block the 3-4 and more looks and uh, I like I like playing nose I was you know it was a little different last year with the 4-3 I, I, I love playing nose and I think it's a it, it was a great switch all right well great thank you Chris for joining us and we appreciate it yep, thank you Ron. all right go Bulldogs that's Chris Dooley